I can't even, I don't even want to say money face before I even. <laughs> hey, y'all, I'm at storage, man. And uh, what we got, man? What we got? Sir? Get it? Let's go, y'all. Welcome back to Chuck's Daily Hustle. All right, y'all. We are on the highway, moving and grooving as always, man. I'm in this today. I'm in the red Chevy Impala, y'all. I don't know if you guys remember this one. It's the LTZ. Um, still clean as much as it could be. This thing was filthy, but anyways, man. Um, I'm going actually out here, bringing this to the office, getting ready to swap with that. Uh, what is that car called? The Oldsmobile Intrigue, you guys. So that thing um, has that power steering issue I was telling you guys about. Um, I did, and I'll show you guys these cars once I get there, um, but that Malibu Max that we got out there with the transmission issue, that joint is most definitely, it most definitely needs a transmission. It doesn't need the shift solenoids. Um, so I ordered up the transmission. Um, that won't be to my office until Monday. So next Monday. So I got a couple days on that. And in the meantime, we're gonna get some more cars done. Um, you know, so that way once Monday hits, we can just slap that transmission in and then we'll be straight. Um, so yeah, man, knock this or uh, what I keep thinking it's a Ori, y'all, but uh, it's an intrigue. Um, and I'm gonna get that knocked out that way we can get that back online, get that thing sold because I had a lot of people that was interested in it. Um, that's actually the cheapest car that I got, you know. So, um, yeah, that's what we're doing, man. Um, if you guys haven't already, man, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button for your boy, man. Um, and then if you guys are new to this channel, man, make sure you hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell, and then turn on all the post notifications. You do that by clicking the all um, tab once you click that bell, all right? Um, and then also, man, the links are in the description below for my social medias, for all the tools I use for the free money, the free stocks, all that good stuff, the crypto, all that stuff, man. So go check me out down there, you guys. I will see you guys Taking in a second. Taking over. Taking over. I'm up, 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 We here at the lot. I am taking the intrigue, you guys. I'm not gonna go over this too much because you guys have seen this a couple of times, man. Um, currently, these are all the cars that are sitting at the lot, you guys. We got the Passat. Um, this is Twan, so I don't know exactly how much we got this online for right now. Of course, we just was out of the Impala. Let me show y'all that because I said I was gonna show you the exterior of this joint for the people that are new to the channel. So here we are, you guys. Did a lot of work to that. Did a whole bunch of work to this edge, man. Glad this thing is finally done. Um, and then we got the Acura uh, MDX right here. And then we got our 12 Impala over there that's been sitting over there lonely. It hasn't started up for at least like two, three weeks, you guys. Um, I'm actually thinking about keeping that one, you guys, because if you guys remember, I don't have any sedans and I'm trying to be humble and not buy a new car because I'm trying to get this money, you guys. So um, the big plan, if I didn't tell y'all, man, is to stock up like crazy. Um, this... Uh, this time right now while the prices are down and then hit them hard during tax time so i'm hoping i'm hoping that we have a like a normal or a better um tax season this year where we uh you know sell a lot of cars um, so i'm hoping like the economy isn't going to go crazy um because i'm gambling right now you guys by um stocking up like this um so i'm trying to fill up everything and then once um tax time comes i'm gonna stay firm on all my prices I will not be negotiating and I will be um, getting rid of all my inventory. So if I got 50 cars at that time, um, if I got 50 cars at that time, y'all, and then if I, let's just do like real simple math. Um, if I'd sold them all at a $500 profit at that time, what is that? $25,000 in tax time. So that's like in two months, maybe. But that's like, on the, that's I'm just low end in that, y'all. Simple math, y'all. So if y'all think about that, you say we sell them at a thousand dollars a piece profit then what is that that's fifty thousand dollars y'all so um i'm trying to most definitely make as much money as i can you guys 
um, and then uh, that way we can get this uh, process accelerated because we are most definitely trying to make some moves, you guys. Um, here, let me show you guys how this thing is driving right now. You guys are moving pretty fast. Um, and right now I'm getting a little wheel bearing noise. I'm not gonna lie about that. Um, but what I'm gonna have him do, man, I'm gonna have him fix that coolant sensor because the, the coolant is all the way full. If you guys can see that little red thing right there. Um, and then I'm gonna have him fix his power steering leak. Um, and then we're gonna go from there, man. So um, let's get it. Here we are, y'all. At the Malibu Max, man. The one that needs this transmission. I don't know why the door's locked. What the heck? Let me see. All right, the key's still in here, so that's good. All right, so yeah, it's gonna start right up, but like I said, man, this thing needs a transmission. So I'm getting ready to take this back to back to my spot for now while we waiting on uh, while we waiting on this dang uh, transmission to get delivered next week. So, um, and then I don't know what the next plan is, you guys. I got a little bit of running that I'm not gonna take you guys with. Got to hit the bank um, and a whole bunch of other stuff. But yeah, man, this thing's pretty clean, man. Once I get this thing up and running, man, I'm gonna make a lot of money on this. I feel like I I don't know about a lot of money, but I'm gonna make some money on it. So let me not over exaggerate, y'all. Um, I do got to get this thing cleaned out too. Um, it is pretty clean, but it smells like cigarettes, so I need to make sure I get that scent out of there. Um, and then that way, the person that buys the car is not smelling that crap. So um, that's the plan, man. Um, I got that Skyon over there sitting. But, uh, I ain't gonna show y'all that right now, you guys. Me, oh, dang. Hold on, man. I hope we ain't got another issue that's gonna come out of this joint. The brakes are kind of soft. Oh, no, we good. All right, we straight. So, all right, man, I'm gonna go to the next destination and we will see what ends up happening. Dig this, y'all. So, I just got a phone call from my old customer and he basically wants me to possibly buy his Honda that I um, actually sold to him back in the day. So, well, not back in the day, it was like a year ago. So, I'm on my way out there right now and we're gonna see if we can work out a deal. Um, it is a Honda Accord and you guys will remember this once I show you the car, if I end up buying it. Um, and yeah, so I'm gonna try to cut a deal with him, make some money off of the deal and go from there. So, he ended up buying, um, he's the same guy that ended up uh, checking out the Dodge Nitro that didn't like it. He ended up buying like a 2020 Mitsubishi something he said um and uh, of course he went and paid a lot of money for it which he could have just like i told him hit me up and i would have made it happen but um he ended up going to the Mitsubishi store and spending a lot of money on whatever he got so um it is what it is i'm going to profit off of what he's gonna uh sell me so um let's get it man um let's hopefully we got we got this thing secured and hopefully it's a good car still let's get it i i, I can't even i don't even want to say money face before i even <laughs> Hey y'all, I'm at storage, man. And uh, what we got, man? What we got secured in the bag, man? Ain't no blue faces yet, but it's a car, it's an automobile. Let's go. So uh, yeah, I most definitely got this joint, man. Um, I bought it for a whopping $425. So about $25 over junk value right now. Um, show y'all what's going on, man. So I'm just gonna need that bumper cover fixed. I might, I'm not replacing none of that. But what I'm thinking, Honestly, thinking, hopefully y'all can hear me, man. It's getting the wind is picking up, but um, I'm thinking I'm gonna get this to my niece, so I don't even think I'm gonna end up selling it. So we'll see how everything goes. But it's gonna need some front tires. Um, it's gonna need that right wheel bearing. This, interior, this thing was cleaned, but they smoke a lot of different things, as y'all can see. Um, so that thing, I don't know what happened there. Um, but yeah, the interior, the headliner is coming down a little bit. Uh, most definitely, I don't know if you guys remember when I put that Android system in. Um, that saved me a lot of um, hassle as far as dealing with that that whole computer in there and all that stuff. So, um, yeah, got that. Um, out here, you guys already know what's out here, man. Uh, we got the Ford Fusion. This thing has finally got that uh, windshield put in, y'all. Got that taken care of. Show y'all the fresh new glass with the, uh, of course, you can see the Band-Aid on there to keep it up. G6, still need to mess with that, man. I got to I gotta get that exhaust fixed. Y'all probably remember that from the video yesterday. We're not going to talk about all these cars, man. I want to keep boring y'all with the same stuff over and over. So, yeah, man, everything pretty much is in place, you guys. You got everything posted. All the stuff is good. We got a light day again today. Y'all, just for the new people that are, like, as far as, like, being a dealer, like, just know that this is normal, all right? So, this is normal season right now um, for it to be slow. So, don't get discouraged. 
Um, I'm gonna be stocking up like crazy. And then, like I said, man, unloading at the end, man. So y'all keep your heads up. Make sure y'all stay blessed, man, prayed up and all that good stuff. Um, oh, I don't even know if I gave y'all the good news, man, but if you stood, if you stuck this far, man, then you already know what's up, man. Um, but guess what, man? I get to keep my dealer's license in the state of Minnesota. So um, hopefully you guys can hear me, man. It is raining a lot right now, you guys. But um, basically they the state backed off, man. Um, and we're good. So I, I don't know if I told you all that before, but I just wanted to let that be known again um, that your boy is 100% good in the state of Minnesota. And so we good, man. I'll see you guys on the next one, man. I'm out. Peace.